Whenever you launch PUBG Mobile from Game Loop, you may face error code 1. This mostly happens when memory integrity is active, as it is a security level feature, or it could be that your game server is disabled from the system configuration. There are many reasons for this error, but let's cover the fix straightforwardly. First, let's make sure the server is active and not disabled in the system configuration. Click on the Windows icon and type msconfig to open the system configuration. Now, go into the Services tab. There will be a lot of Windows services, so we need to first hide Microsoft services to easily navigate the installed program services. Now, find QM Emulator Service and make sure it is running and not unchecked. If it is unchecked, enable it. Then restart your PC and try again. In most cases, this will resolve the issue if the error is caused by this service. Secondly, we need to ensure that memory integrity is disabled. Uh, press the Windows key, then type Windows Security and open it. Find Device Security and open it. Now, go into Core Isolation Details and make sure memory integrity is disabled. If you don't see this feature or it shows this setting is managed by your administrator, follow the next step. This is likely controlled by Registry Editor or Group Policy Editor, which many people modify without realizing its effect. First, open Registry Editor typing regedit and hitting Enter. Navigate to the destination I will provide in the description. Simply copy and paste it to access the exact settings. Now, in Device Guard, make sure the key Enable Virtualization Based Security Value is set to zero or simply right-click on it and delete it. Next, go into Hypervisor Enforced Code Integrity and change the Enabled key value from 1 to 0. After this, restart your PC and try again. Your problem should be 100% resolved. If this video helps you a lot, please hit the subscribe button and share it with your friends. Another thing I want to mention, many people are stuck at 60 FPS, which is quite annoying, but I found a solution to unlock up to 90 FPS. Stay tuned, I'll cover that topic as soon as possible.